Come on, Harry. I can see you down there. Yeah, it's your little nose and you. <laughs> Come on, Harry. Out of there. You can't sleep indoors, you know. Cause me a hell of a ruckus. Oh, yeah, and you've been under the wardrobe. So many ages to get him out quietly. <laughs> and he's like, look, he's bright by the radiator. Come on, Harry. Let's, let's get you moved. Yeah? Nice. Oh, he's trying to go into a bit of a ball there. Which is not what we want. I don't know why he's tried to... Well, he's trying to pretend that he's not there. Now, let me find and get something just to nudge him into a ball. Let me have a little look. Ah, oh, we are. My trusty walking stick. I should be able to just get in behind him. Come on, Harry. You turn into a ball, you see, if I touch him, and then hopefully he can. Come on, Harry. Come on. Oh, I don't want to touch him particularly. What's this thing in the way? What's that? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Come on, Harry. Now oh, turn into a little ball for me. Come on. Come on. Oh, dear, I, I, I can't get any. Oh, this might work. Come on, Harry. I just tap him on the backside. There he is. Come on, Harry. Now he's really small, I think, compared to the others that we've seen around. Now, how could I block up that part where he's just come from? If I put that there, that might help. Yes. Oh dear. If I put what's in there. Oh crikey. There's a few extra emergency sleeping bags. Now, right. He's now oh. He can't get through there. He's probably down behind there somewhere, he is. But I don't like him to think he can stay indoors. All right, yeah, that's heavy. Oh, no, he's down there somewhere. Down under here. Can you see him under there? Harry, come on. Right, okay, well... It's all pretty secure here now. He ain't going to get himself back into the... Oh, crikey, I think I strained a muscle in me back with all the mana palaver earlier. But let's just withdraw and see if he'll run out on his own. Oh, crikey. Without... Any more fuss. It's down there. It's just down there. Somewhere. Come on, Harry. Goodness me. It's four in the morning. And I'm woken by the scratchings of Harry the Hedgehog. And do I mind? No. I sleep any time, but 
so I don't often get the chance to see Harry. I think that might be it. He's just couldn't. I know he's safe anyway there. He can't get round in the house and into trouble earlier when he was. Oh, crikey. In the wardrobe, but. Dear. What a night. <laughs>